Serbia has a big decision to make. With a presidential election on Sunday, voters are having to take into account just how much Russia's invasion of a neighboring country has impacted their own. The war in Ukraine has entirely changed the campaign in Serbia. Several topics like fighting corruption used to be a priority, but they're not in the forefront anymore. Now people are mostly interested in economic stability. President Alexander Vucic is running for re-election, and many polls indicate he's likely to win. But he's found himself stuck between bolstering traditional ties with Russia and his country's aspiration of joining the European Union. Critics say achieving both seems unlikely. We said that in the region, Serbia will play an absolutely constructive role, that we will keep the peace, that we are not interested in the territories of others, that we are interested in economic cooperation. In March, Serbia voted in favor of a UN resolution condemning Russia's actions in Ukraine, but refused to impose sanctions on Russia. Now two decades after its own war in the Balkans, Serbs are feeling the impact of war yet again. Inflation is at an all-time high, and basic foods are becoming pricier. Everything has become more expensive. You can no longer buy what you bought last month. There are always two or three fewer items. If incumbent President Aleksandr Vucic wants another term in office, he needs to keep the support of the Serbs who support Russia, while also appealing to those struggling to make ends meet. Leah Harding, Al Jazeera.